Okay, at the beginning of the psyllium tau form, our feet are together. The first thing to move is your dantian in your center. So your center drops onto your hip and your spine stretches. And then when you, this drop happens inside the body, all the, all the joints open, you connect your mass into your fascia. So you've got a relaxed stretch and everything becomes connected. And this is the birth of movement, dropping. You need to drop into the fascia to connect mass to the fascia to generate motion. So this exercise, as we just have our feet together, we drop and we bring our hands up. And because we're dropping, our body weight arrives on our hands as we drop. Because I'm stretching onto him, I drop, I connect body weight. So this dropping to connect body weight, if you want to come forward a little bit for me, you can be touching inside, touching outside, drop, and come underneath your training partner. Now he's giving me a high center of gravity and a tension line, so as I'm touching him, he's giving me something to play with so that I can come underneath him. He's not being dead weighted or, or, or jelly body for this exercise. So your, your, your core moves first, it drops. And from there, everything opens and stretches and you transfer the gravity into your fascia. And this is the opening of the form. So some styles will do a movement like this, other styles will do a folding back fist, but this is the birth of movement. Drop your center, activate the fascia, move the hands up. Now, if I was going to intercept an incoming punch and there's a punch coming in, I want to drop and, and get that line as efficiently, get my arms up, intercept as quickly as possible. So from here, I'm dropping to get connection. If I just lift my hand up, I have no connected mass and he's just going to bridge through. So let's say I wanted to, wanted to strike. So I would drop, as you strike, I would drop and put my body weight straight into the strike at the fastest possible way. So there's no quicker way to get my hand from there to there with power than dropping, stretching, and activating my mass in my hands. So whether you're doing a parry, whether you're doing a, um, an intercept, this is the quickest way to get connected mass onto your target, that your center drops first. And as your center drops, everything goes into the fascia, all your weight goes into the fascia. You take a line from there to the target, slightly curved, and you connect your mass. Very, very, very simple. So this is how we open the form. If you're standing in front of a, a punching bag or a wall bag, you drop and get your hands onto the, onto the bag, whether it's in a punch, onto the wooden dummy, and use this dropping method. If you're doing any pad work, get used to punching from down here. You're not going to have your hands up in a self-defense situation. You're going to be surprised. From the low position, you have to get your hands up to the high position. So practice how you drop your body weight, connect your mass, and generate power. Okay, thank you for your time. See you in the next video.